Welcome to Mother Bird Blog. and welcome back to Mother Bird Blog channel. If you're new here, I'm Zara and I'm 22, mummy to two girls, Ruby who's two and Lucy who's one. And today's video is all about our bugaboo donkey. So, having two girls 14 months apart was amazing, but picking a pram was a lot of hard work. It was a really hard decision about whether to pick having the girls side by side or a tandem, so one on top of another. We did end up going with the Bugaboo, Bugaboo Bonkey, I oh, keep saying Bugaboo Bonkey, Bugaboo Donkey, which is side by side. So a lot of comments I always get from you all is, does it fit through doors? Like, is it really hard when you're out and about? So I thought, what better way to show you than do my very own Bugaboo Donkey review? So I hope you enjoy. Let's go. So this is our Bugaboo Donkey in duo mode the grey malang or however you say it getting through doors is never a problem this is something people always ask as long as a shop or a house is disabled friendly the pram will fit through any door that wide so honestly it looks bigger than it is really assembling it is quite easy too i got time to do this because you know He's a lot better at this kind of stuff. You just slide it out by pressing three buttons into the duo mode, clip all the clips and pop the chairs and the board on. I can honestly say we have never had a problem with our bugaboo donkey now. So durability wise, it's definitely been put to the test. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> The buggy board is an extra attachment we bought and that is brilliant now for Ruby who is two and a half. It does have an extending hood which I'm showing you now on when you extend it normally but it also has a zip so you can extend it further. This is fab from sunny days. The hood literally comes down to the child's knees or for when the kids are sleeping. So when they're sleeping as well, there's three chair positions which is really handy so they can lie flat when they're sleeping. We've upgraded to the leather handles. This makes them more wipeable, which is a bonus for sticky fingers. And it has a safety strap. I've never used this feature though. We did buy the Bugaboo a phone holder, which I'd really recommend because I do not have enough hands as it is. So it definitely helps. It's got adjustable height settings which was a fab key for me because I'm really tall I always have it on the highest but if you do want to adapt it you just pull the bar up and down after doing these. The basket is one of my favourite things. I managed to get a full week's food shop in here. It has three pockets in which is always handy if you don't want your purse or things to slide out and the basket extends when the pram goes into duo does have a steering lock feature not quite sure why unless you're deciding to go down the a1 why you'd ever need your pram just to go in a straight line but it has that feature anyway as you can see it's really smooth and easy to push even when you go on grass things like that it's not hard to push at all and i push it on gravel some days when we go to our kids clubs Here's Tom modelling it. Oh, look at the way he walks. Ruby always holds on to the bars when she has the board. And, you know, here's us testing it out. Go on, Tom. Push it real good. It's super light, even with both kids on the pram. And the steering is just absolutely fan dabby dozy So we're out and about with our pram. So what's your favourite thing? Uh, buggy board. Just wish buggy, board. board. buggy board. What's your favourite thing about the pram? Um, buggy board. Buggy board. Cece, what's your favourite thing? <laughs> all in all, we love our bugaboo donkey and I'd recommend it to anyone. And this is Tom putting it away. It is just as simple as packing it up. It fits in our car and there is enough room for a weekly food shop as well so it's not even that big you just have to stack it up see you later and that's 
everything. So all in all, we actually really, really love, oh my God, that really went. <laughs> we really, really love our Buckaboo donkey. Oh my God, my heart is racing. <laughs> we, yeah. So all in all, we really love our Buckaboo donkey and I would recommend it to anybody else. We've now had it for two whole years and even Tom loves pushing it. So I hope you liked what you saw today. If you liked what you saw today, make sure that you give us a big thumbs up, give us a like, hit the subscribe button, come join the Mother Bird Blog family, and also drop me a comment. Have you got the Bugaboo Donkey? What do you think about the Bugaboo Donkey? Or what made you decide not to get it? See you all soon. Love you.